We're at Cornell Farms in their brand new beautiful event space. And this is Thomas Payne, and he's the one responsible for the beautiful look in here. I love this. You've really done a fantastic job of bringing the outdoors in. That was the goal, right? Yeah, thank you, Robin. Thanks for coming to Cornell Farm. The, uh, yeah, the goal was to take whatever is available at this nursery, which is nestled right in the heart of Portland, and find whatever is available and bring it in and to kind of bring the outdoors inside, particularly for the winter. Yeah, but you don't just bring it in. <laughs> you have it designed and executed so beautifully. Obviously, we can copy this look, but, but how do you know to do it yourself? It's, um, not all of it is from Cornell Farm, but what we've done is we've taken choice pieces and statement pieces that would be typically on an outdoor porch. And as you know, in the Northwest, it gets very cold in the winter. Not everyone gets to spend as much time outside. Mm -hmm. So what we've done is that we have brought a lot of that indoors so that you're not deprived of the outdoors all winter long. It's, pretty, it's a pretty lush environment to be indoors and surrounded by plants and you know all the extra oxygen and, and right. so, so you get that outdoor fix even in the middle of winter. Absolutely and you don't necessarily have to bring in just the most brilliant of colors I've noticed. You, you've used a lot of white in here. Yeah, the, given the color spectrum that we've chosen for this event space, the, uh, we thought the white in contrast with the, the sort of dramatic color on the wall, it just it really kind of brightened it up. It gave you a lot of light in a house that doesn't necessarily have a lot of natural light. Right, it's very so. beautiful. Now, I know you have another trick that you're gonna show us with a different kind of bringing the outdoors in. So mm. let's go in the other room and check it out. Okay. This is another room of this beautiful event space here at Cornell Farm. It's a 1900s, early 1900s farmhouse. And this room has actually come alive with what Thomas has done in here. This is gorgeous. Oh, thank you. This is a garden in a pot. <laughs> it is an entire garden in so a very is, large pot. It is, in fact, like over 100 plants, I think, just in this one plot, this, this one pot. Wow. It, it's lots of the little, mm -hmm. um, little stone crop uh, supplemented with little succulents and orchids. And so, yeah, it's, a, it's just it's a whole garden, and, a whole yard in a pot. And even if you don't have such a large container, you can make the same concept in a smaller size and bring all that into your home. Absolutely. You know, I mean, like this old trophy. It's an old French racing trophy, and I we just threw that. five plants in it. And it's just, you know, it can go anywhere, on a mantle, on a table. So it's... And then it's you have <laughs> this, this big This large rapist bomb. <laughs> it's huge. So this room really needed something to... Uh, to pick it up and carry it and just give it scale. So it's, it's a large piece and it definitely takes the place of an outdoor tree. So it's definitely And large. I've also noticed that what you've done in here has played very well off of the existing artwork here in the room. Yeah, the artwork, well, the artwork was donated by the Calogram Falcon program. And this particular artist, Nathan Praska, uh, the nature series that he did is, this one over here above the fireplace is called Autumn in the City. And uh, this one over here is a little bit darker, but they are all part of a nature series, which kind of fit into the natural Cornell Farm, you know, nursery aesthetic. Absolutely. This room is just beautiful, and a large part of it is due to the fact that there are so many living and breathing things in here. It's, it is. It's, it was set up to look like a living room. And uh, what we did is, you know, through Thomas Paine Atelier, we donated uh, furniture from it, you know, from the showroom. And we wanted to give people the idea that they could live here, and this is how they would live in an environment with lots of plants. Yes, absolutely. Thank you so much, Thomas. Uh, thank this you is so much. Absolutely beautiful. And you can see it at Cornell Farm. And we also have a link on how you can get in touch with this talented guy on our website, okay. fusionnw.com.